All right, guys, here we are at BTC in Vegas, and I've got my hands on, that's right, hands on the Avalon Q by Can Ann here, Can Ann at the booth. And uh, this thing is like, maybe it's a little bit bigger than like those old school Optiplex 7020s. You remember those workstations, like the full size, but it's thin. So it's like a, a, a small form factor this way, but like a large form factor that way. And the wireless on it is currently with a USB dongle, so there's no like built-in Wi-Fi. Of course, an Ethernet cable. We've got uh, a little display and a reset button and power button on the front. But on the back, check this out, guys. This runs on 120, so you can just plug this in. You don't need to remove your stove, get rid of your dryer. You can just plug this in anywhere inside, and it it kind of looks like, you know what? Hold on a second. All right, so I'm gonna open this up. Don't tell anyone, okay? We're gonna look at what's inside. Maybe. Are these security bits on the end? All right, what about this one? Let's get it open. Come on. Quick, before they look. They're looking. Okay, that one's that one's good. This one? That one too? Did I get it done? Okay, and it opens just like a, a Optiplex, like a workstation too. All right, let's look at this. First look on the inside of the queue. We got these monstrous bus bars here. Why do they need such large bus bars for 120 volts? I wonder how many amps this thing is pulling. That's the question. These are, goodness, look at the size of these heat sinks. Holy cow. We got our power supply here. We've got our control board. A couple of 120 mil fans. Man, and okay, so we've got our got our PCB in there, we can't really see much else. A couple more fans on the back. Okay, so we've got our full cross flow here. Oh man, we're getting an audience now. We got a bunch of people checking this out. All right guys, that's it. This is the inside of the Avalon Q. Um, you saw it here first, guys. Make sure you get your hands on this. This is gonna be sick, 120 volts, 90 terahash. That's like my S19, but I don't need to replace the stove to run it.